morning. Well, today is going to be another great day. It is about 8.15 and I'm on the trail. Uh, I had a great night's sleep last night. It was cool and nice. And there was a little critter running around in the brush up above my head. I heard him. I don't know what it was. But it's a nice day today. It's going to get worse as the day goes on. And uh, I'm hiking 12 and a half miles today into town. So I know it's going to be ups and downs, but really, it's a good day. So today is a weird day. It's a beautiful day right now, but there are these gusts of wind that come up. And I know it's because there's a storm coming tonight and uh, it's just a changing weather pattern. But um, I can hear branches coming down from high up in the trees. Cause look, look how tall these trees are. And the wind is way up there, not down where I am. And they're like shaking, the wind is shaking loose branches and they're coming down and acorns are coming down like little bombs. So I'm like, oh, am I gonna get hit with something? That end, man alive, my right knee does not want to uh, cooperate today. It is not in a good place. It hurts a lot. I have a good knee brace on. I've even adjusted it, tightened it. So today is, I'm just going to have to muscle through and know that I get to rest tomorrow and uh, take care of myself. But today, I don't know, today's a weird day. It's a good day, it's a beautiful day, but it's a painful day and I really hope I don't get hit by anything. Cause these trees are, I'm telling you, they are wicked tall. So we'll see. I hope I don't get hit by anything. That would really be bad. Well, I stopped at the Tumbling Run shelter. There are two shelters here and in between another covered picnic table. These shelters in Pennsylvania, man, they are awesome. And so I'm at the fire pit with actual like benches that people made and volunteered their time, little fire pit. And then behind me is the privy, which had air fresheners and toilet paper, huge. And back there is where you go to tent. This is a great spot. Not staying here, but it is a great spot. <laughs> My knees, uh, my right knee still is barking at me. So I'm just taking my time. I've rested twice already. I'm gonna rest again and uh, I'll be, I'll get there. So I just checked into the Cobblestone Hotel and they're super nice. It's a beautiful little hotel. There's where I'm gonna eat breakfast tomorrow. And I asked Amy at the front desk, she's super nice, if um, I could use their freezer because tomorrow, is my half gallon challenge. Oh yeah. So it's gonna rain. Why do I need a half gallon of ice cream? So that's what I'm gonna do tomorrow. I'm gonna walk down to Walmart uh, tonight and grab a half gallon of something that I can stand <laughs> and enjoy. So I'm loving it. So we thought we were going to Mexican, but we're not. That's Trudger's meal. It looks amazing. It's a pesto panini, and I got a Cuban panini with sweet potato fries, and I'm so excited to eat it. Yes, it's beautiful. This is beautiful. After that nice meal, I am now at Walmart getting my flu shot and a COVID booster because self-care is important. So I'm going to do a resupply as well, but yep. So uh, I'm in line right there. My friend Trudge is there getting hers right now, and then uh, it's my turn. And then uh, I can do a little resupply here at Walmart, which is walking distance to the hotel, which is amazing. Mm -hmm. 